the Dawn Run Maiden Hurdle is next. And this is over two miles and three furlongs. And at the top we've got Ard Maid Belch for James Shea. Boravine for Daniel French. Fair Watson for James Shea again. Cole Cates to Grey. Honeysuckle Paul Rhodes. Jazzy Lady Graham Clutterbuck. And Twisted Island Alex Cherry. They're called in and away then in the rain. And Honeysuckle is the first to show. Being joined by Twisted Island. And Boirovine is back in third. Then Cole Kate is fourth. As they make their way through the rain to the first of ten. And they're all safely over that one with the James Shea pair at the back. Hard made Belch and Fair Watson. But the field is very tightly grouped at this point. It doesn't look like anything's all that keen to lead. Honeysuckle and Twisted Island are currently sharing the lead, but neither of them seems all that keen to go on. And Hardway Belch was the last a minute ago. It looked like he was going to come through the challenge, and it has now dropped right back to last again. So this is going to be a bit of a crawl, I think. It's not quite wet enough for a front crawl, but anyway, they get over the second, and they're all safely over it. And Twisted Island is the leader. From Honeysuckle on the inside, second. Jazzy Lady is third. In Fair Watson, and then a line of three called Kate Ardmay, Belch, and Boirovine. So they come up past the stand then. I take this flight that'll be the last on the next circuit. And they're all safely over it. And the pace is beginning to so quicken a little bit. Looks like Twisted Island and Honeysuckle have decided to take the lead on between them. And those two are pulling two or three lengths clear of Jazzy Lady back in third. In Fair Watson and called Kate. And Ardmay, Belch, and then Boirovine on the outside of the pale jacket. So, at the fourth then, and all nicely over that one. The orange sleeves, half twisted on and just showing in front. On Honeysuckle, for Paul Rhodes, gap off four lengths or so then to Jazzy Lady and Fair Watson. As they get over the fifth, good chunk there by Fair Watson in third. Hardmay Belch now the back marker. But the pace just quickened a little bit as they come down towards the fifth flight. With Twisted Iron and Honeysuckle still disputing the lead. In a fair Watson and Cool Kate. It'll actually be the sixth flight, the next one. As we see them from the other side of the track. You can see the stand in the distance. That's where they've got to get to. Nine furlongs away it is. And Twisted Island and Honeysuckle are disputing the lead from Fair Watson and Cool Kate Fallens back here in third. Then Jazzy Lady, Boiravine is moving a bit closer. Hardway belches at the back as they get over the sixth, which they're all safely over. There's four more to take then. And Twisted Island in front from Honeysuckle second. Gap of five then to Cool Kate who's moving into third. Boiravine is the one who's making significant progress around the outside. Jazzy Lady just Maybe hit a bit of a flat spot on the two James Shea horses, Fair Watson and Ardmay Belcher at the back as they take the fourth last. Where Twisted Island was a neck up on Honeysuckle. Gap of five then to Cool Cake being pushed along as they make their way towards the next. Then they've got three more flights to take and they've got just over five furlongs to race. And Twisted Island is the first one to kick for home. And has gone two lengths clear of Honeysuckle. It looks to be going well enough, still in second. Five length gap back to Cool Cake and Jazzy Lady is running on again. Boiravine on the outside is still there. Fair Watson and Ardmay Belcher close enough if good enough. They come down towards the third last flight then. And over that one they go and it's Twisted. Island who's jumped it well in front but a better jump by Honeysuckle and the, the jockey's just eased back on that one again doesn't want it to hit the front too soon but Twisted Island's kicked on and Twisted Island is in the lead from Honeysuckle in second then a gap back to Colgate and Jazzy Lady Boiravine is flattered to deceive and now looks beaten so too does Hardmay Belch and Fair Watson they're coming down towards the second last flight then now and Twisted Island's in front Twisted Island gets to the second last gets over it nicely Honeysuckle over it in second then Jazzy Lady and Colgate but it's Twisted Island and who's clear coming down towards the final flight looking like he's only going to jump it to take this one but Honeysuckle's trying to close coming down towards his final flight now and suddenly Honeysuckle is going much the better of the two Twisted Island sending out Distress Stickles jumped it slightly better here comes Jazzy Lady with a good looking one on the outside Honeysuckle hits the front Jazzy Lady's trying to close Honeysuckle just from Jazzy Lady and then Twisted Island third fair Watson fourth and then Boiravine and Ardmay Belcher back to Cool Kate who was the last one to finish in the end but it looked like Twisted Island was going to hang on, but Honeysuckle just managed to wear it down. Nearly got caught by Jazzy Lady as well. So, 
three of them in with a chance to jump in the final flight in the end. Honeysuckle takes it there for Paul Rhodes. Jazzy Lady was second for Graham Clutterbuck. Twisted Island Alex Cherry third. Fair Watson for James Shea was fourth. And Boiravine for Daniel French was fifth.